हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू द ऑनलाइन क्लासेस ऑफ थर्ड सेमेस्टर इंजीनियरिंग मैथमेटिक्स दिस इज डॉक्टर किरण पोदार अंगड़ी इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी एंड मैनेजमेंट बेलगावी इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस एन एग्जांपल ऑन वेरिएशनल प्रॉब्लम्स बाय यूजिंग यूलर्स इक्वेशन व्हिच वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड इन द प्रीवियस क्लास एज पर यूलर इक्वेशन व्हाट इज टू बी कैलकुलेटेड फाइंड द एक्सट्रीमल ऑफ द फंक्शन integration of y dash plus x square y dash square with respect to x between x1 to x2 this is the example given it is something like i is equal to very first what i do i'll be taking it as i let i is equal to integration from x1 to x2 of uh, y dash plus x square y dash square with respect to x which is same as integration from x1 to x2 of f of x comma y comma y dash with respect to x means here we are having f of x comma y comma y dash is equal to its function what is that function function is y dash plus x square into y dash square fine so this is the function here then uh we have a euler's equation what euler's equation says euler's equation says do f by do y minus d by dx of do f by do y dash is equal to 0 so this is the euler equation which we have discussed in a previous class okay so by using this result we are going to obtain a solution of getting extremal of the given function how do you get see here since the given function is this then as per this what are required here uh, differentiation of f with respect to y is required what is the differentiation of f with respect to y you can see here is there any y here no y dash is there y dash is different y is different okay so y term is not there when we differentiate this f with respect to y when the term is not there it becomes zero fine then differentiation of f with respect to y dash is required that can be differentiated so differentiating this f with respect to y dash will be what differentiation of y dash with respect to y dash is 1 plus x square common and differentiation of y dash square will be 2 times y dash 2 times y dash and alternate term if we give y dash square common and differentiation of x term will be zero therefore if i call it as equation number 1 then equation number 1 becomes equation number 1 becomes substitute the value then it becomes zero minus d by dx of 1 plus 2x square y dash is equal to 0 fine this can be taken as since it is gone so what remains now minus d by dx of 1 plus 2x square y dash is equal to 0 or else if you remove this minus then it becomes plus got my point if you send it to the other end it becomes plus then what happens since since this is a, a differentiation it is a derivative so to obtain a function what is to be done integrating i'll write it once again integrating this with respect to x if you integrate this with respect to x it becomes integration of d by dx of 1 plus 2x square into y dash with respect to x is equal to is equal to integration of zero with respect to x. Okay, with respect to x plus constant. Fine. Therefore, plus constant I'll take k1. Then what is integration of this with respect to x? D by dx get cancelled. Therefore, it becomes 1 plus 2x square 1 plus 2x square into y dash is equal to k1 fine therefore from here we need to 
get what is the value of y dash. If we take, then it becomes 2x square y dash is equal to a1 minus 1, then y dash is equal to a1 minus 1 divided by 2x square. And we know that y dash is nothing but y dash is nothing but dy by dx. So once again apply integration with respect to x, then it becomes integration of dy by dx is equal to integration of k1 minus 1 divided by 2x square with respect to x. So here what we do, we will be taking it as integration of dy by dx is nothing but y that is equal to a1 minus 1 divided by 2 will be taken as a constant then it is integration of 1 divided by x square with respect to x. Fine. Therefore, this is nothing but y is equal to k1 minus 1 divided by 2 into integration of 1 divided by x square. What is integration of 1 divided by x square? Integration of 1 divided by x square is minus 1 divided by x plus when the integration is being applied then automatically what happens here k2 will come second constant will come so that plus k2 therefore if you take it properly or else if you put put k minus 1 divided by 2 is equal to c is equal to c then this y becomes c c into this result but uh, what i do i'll, I'll uh, to avoid this minus sign what we will be taking we will be taking it as y is equal to uh, k1 minus 1 is there i'll be taking 1 minus k1 divided by 2 into 1 by x plus k2 means replacing this will is not possible replacing 1 minus k is equal to c okay because only to avoid negative sign therefore 1 minus k1 by 2 is replaced by c then this divided by x plus k2 therefore this is the value of y when this is the value of y so we can say that we have got the function ext extremal of the functional of the given example which is equal to y is